Hey, buddy. Hi. Uh, hello, everybody. This is an intro. We, we never introduced our audio. We never synced the audio between us. Okay, there we go. Now, yeah. this is the intro. Thanks for remembering, because that would have pissed me off a little bit. Yeah. Um, yeah, so if you're wondering why it looks like shit, uh, reasons. <laughs> Marcus' computer is bad. So we thought we finally had fixed everything, right? Yeah. But we did not. It turns out it's just my processor that's ass. So, uh, anyone... Possibly. Yeah, anyone thinking about buying a processor, avoid Ryzen 5th Gen like the Plague. Um, well, I I'll, would I'll say like the Plague, because I've worked with 5th Gen quite a bit. It's just one of those things where like you just happen to have a bad processor. Yep, and I don't want to take the chance and get another 5th Gen for it to just immediately also be shitty. Yeah, because I had 4th Gen Ryzen. I had a Ryzen 9, actually, one of the best Ryzen you can get for that series. And it was really good. Oh, wow, well, and you were saying, too, like the... Even gens are the iffy ones. Yeah, they're the iffy ones personally, but I like mine. Mine was really good. Mine was a good boy. That's good. It allowed me to stream and allowed me to do like 4K video editing you to, for people. You, you, you cut off. It allowed me to, to stream and do 4K video editing. Team? Stream and do 4K video editing. <laughs> I'm probably going to have to ask you to repeat a lot today. I heard no, it. That it's time, fine. Though. That's uh, funny because you you listen to the audio, just me saying the same thing. Yep, they'll be oh, like, "Fucking, what? He heard you the first time." No, I didn't. N nope. He's Stream on Discord right 4K now. 4K video audio. Yep. There's so much fucking jank going on right now, and this is this is only temporary. I did order the new processor. It will be here latest within two to three weeks, hopefully sooner. I will not. I will no longer be available. Which is within the time. Yeah, which is fine. It. It said the earliest is by the end of this month, and then the latest is like the middle of next month. So it's possible you will be here and available, but I doubt it, with based on how my luck has been with this whole thing. Streaming and 4K video editing. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. You could just uh, answer every question from now on with streaming and 4K video editing. doing before. I guess I'm exploring, trying to figure out where to go. Streaming and 4K video editing. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Streaming 4K video editing. Ah, oh, yes, yes. Thank you. That helps a lot. Streaming and 4K video editing. Gotcha. But no problem, what about <laughs> streaming? And 4K video editing. Oh, okay. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> See, so... When we worked on your computer, and you mentioned that, like, the one word that I say a lot, like, Carlos is shambles. Yep. And shit like that. And you said it was hell yeah. You say it more than I do sometimes. Like, you'll start... Oh, I do? Yeah. And I told you, it's 100% you infected me with this, <laughs> and now it's all I say. Now, my default setting is hell yeah. I have a mannerism where, like, I'll hook my arm and hand, like, straight up, and I'll just wave my hand back and forth, like, as, like, a no thank you kind of thing. And a lot of times, people don't realize it. My buddy Carol, he's like, you're a bastard. Because now every time I say no thank you, I do that motion. I'm like, yeah, <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> Just out of spite. Eh, I quite view, no. I'm sorry, why does it sound like you have all of the indigestion? Because I do. I ate a nice big bowl of ass. Anyhow, I'm not surprised you survived the trek through these shimmering caverns. Yeah, 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 yeah. The caverns are great, but tell me more about that ass. Was she double caked up? Nah, like a bakery. Oh hell yeah. <laughs> you said the word again. Fuck you. <laughs> but with that being the case, there's a strength about you. I suspect it would be quite intimidating if not for your small stature. I'm working on these buns too, you know. I'm not double cake, but I'm, I'm working on it. Yeah, yes. You're simply like a hostess cake, like a Twinkie, if you will. Yeah, you know, some, some plus-sized donuts. Feel free to, to look at my ass as I walk away. Maybe some point you'll be like the giant egg pussy. Dude, goals. <laughs> <laughs> You, everybody wants the affection of Ed, egg fucker. Egg, egg goosey. 
Egg Goosey. Egg can Goosey. I? Why can I only jump on some of this? Because you're not supposed to be able to jump up there. But I, I want to cheat the system. All right. Oh, Marcus. I just came up with a new deck idea as far as for on arena, so I'm excited. I currently have three I built. Have you made any of yours yet? Nope, I'm still playing the basic game to build up cards. Oh. Oh yeah, to explain to everyone, we finished Hollow Knight. And... We did not finish uh, Hollow Knight. <laughs> yeah, we finished Hollow Knight. This is not Hollow Knight anymore, this is Little Nightmares. Oh, okay. I uh, know, we finished Little Nightmares. And, um, I have no other games that I want to play in the meantime. So I'm challenging Marcus to a duel. This is the official on the channel duel. That next week Friday, on the channel, instead of a horror game, Challenge you to fit some fucking Magic the Gathering Arena, motherfucker. Oh, hell yeah. I can't wait for you to see these janky the jank. builds. Yeah, I made... you... oh. This dude's the jank king. Like, we'll play DBS and he'll show me some jank. I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> I have one deck that's comprised of two cards. See, what's funny, though, is that... Because Marcus has never really played Magic the Gathering with me. I've, I've made whispers of how I've played Magic the Gathering. And he's only played DBS with me. I take DBS somewhat seriously because I did like turn like nationals and state and shit like that for that. And right. you, you were just, I could tell that you d took a double take like, is this really Dylan playing Magic? Because <laughs> I'm a fucking crackhead when I play. Yeah, you just kind of don't care when it comes to Magic. It's, it's really something. <laughs> Yeah, it's, it's the funniest thing because, like, I, I'm used to losing Ow. in Magic. And I just think Magic's so much fun because it's just bullshit 80% of the time. I mean, yeah. <laughs> you have you have so many cards in that game since it's been around for so long. It's like, yeah, I activate this card that says, fuck you, your entire game plan doesn't work anymore. It's like, oh, okay. Yeah, yeah and Marcus uh, has never played, like, Commander. He's played Standard and Modern, thanks to MTG Arena. We yeah. didn't really play like traditional commander. So shuffling a hundred card deck and everything was a little bit, you know, intimidating and all that other fun shit. A lot. Yeah. And of course, before my buddy Cole or my buddy Kevin pulled up, we played with some random guy that we just met at the three man game. And oh man, you saw the jank that was my deck. <laughs> yeah, you had like a reanimator graveyard deck and it was um it was not good. <laughs> What's funny though is that it's actually really good when you know what to do. Like there's some cheap jank combos in there that actually work well. I mean, you saw when we were playing the four-man game, I was actually doing decent. Yeah, but that was also because no one was targeting you, and then as soon as I started targeting you, you were wiped out of the game. Yeah. So it's like you're you're missing a lot of the good protection that a graveyard deck needs. Uh, to prevent dying immediately from being exiled of your graveyard and whatnot. See, you say that, but here's the thing. It's in there. I just don't draw good. <laughs> I just... well, Look, okay. Out of all three of my decks, my best one is my ghost shits. Okay? Uh, see, with you, this? I only saw you briefly play that one. Yeah, that one's actually my best deck. That's why I don't play that often. Okay. My, my my garbage recycling bin deck, which is Lodrotha, I'm okay with. It's, it's my favorite deck because she's my favorite. And then there's Rick with this. Yeah. Fuck Rick with this. He's yeah. such a bitch. You did a lot of nothing that game. Yep. Because all he does is a whole lot of nothing. Well, it'd be like this sometimes. And the one time that like the group's like, guys, you do something. I'm like, okay, I'll try to milk as much as I can out so Cole does not win the whole fucking game. Because he played a gate deck. Oh, that's death down there. Oh. Also, this is, like, really cursed because we're not... You're not playing this on your PC, are you? You're playing this on your Xbox. Yep, sure am. I plugged in my dusty old Xbox One and I was like, oh, shit. This yeah. exists. And oh, that's, that's how that so works? Tired. That's fucking crazy. Okay. And what's really jank for me is the fact that I can't hear a damn thing that's happening. So, like, in my mind, I'm going... Oh, uh, I can't hear it either because it's out of my TV and I have my headphones plugged into my computer so that I can hear you. Fuck. Fuck. I'm panicking. Oh, okay. 
There ah. you go, that's your that's your little daily dose of Police Academy, like soundtrack man. Bro, this timing is ass. Okay, alright. Yeah. Alright. Yeah, I don't know what's happening there, but you're getting your shit rocks, sir. It it sucks. I'm glad I'm out of there. I'm not going back through that again. Fuck that. Shortcut, please, sir. Please. So I ended up you know I ended up getting a switch recently and everything, right? I do. And you know how I picked up Legends of Arceus? I do. I didn't like Legends of Arceus. No? Man, I I think I'm you know how you always say you're like you're Oh that's a that's a dildo. Oh no, that's a gun. That's a straight up gun. Huh. Hold what well, on the crown of Huh. I thought it was gonna be a double jump. But it's a super dash. Do it. This can get us through so many places. Oh, neat. This can help us in so many different ways, dude. Oh my god. This it's, is so needed. Okay, it said I can do this also when I'm clinging to a wall. Ah! Oh! So this is literally, shit. um, whatchamacallit. It's, a uh, fucking Metroid. What's, what's that ability called? I don't know. I don't play. I never played Metroid. Uh, I forget what this ability You just is. keep going, oh my god. Yeah, it literally is just like it. Because uh, basically, once Samus gets the super dash ability, after you're dashing, you can hold down. Um, yeah. Oh, shit. Um, <laughs> I could not stop. Uh, but yeah, it basically lets her do that. Okay. It's pretty cool. And then they add a lot of interesting puzzles with it, because if you uh, crouch while you're doing the dash, you can, like, stop at certain points and try to chain it together. Sick. Oh, yeah, like I was saying, um, you know how you say you're an old man with literally everything in life? Mm hmm I had one of those moments when I was playing Pokemon Legends of Arceus. What is that? Because I haven't played a Pokemon game since Pokemon Diamond back on the DS. Oh no. And I had one of those old fat, like, fat boy DS's that were bricky. Right. And I'm playing Legends of Arceus, and I'm like, okay, this story's interesting. Oh cool, I know Cyndaquil. I've seen Rowlette from memes. Right. Fuck Oshawott. Fuck Oshawott. Continue. And I'm like, alright, cool, 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 this game's talking to me like I'm fucking stupid and I don't know what a Pokemon is. Alright, yep, cool. Yep, nope, that's how a Pokemon game is. You're stupid, you can't comprehend. And I I'm... Oh, oh I nope. can't stop. And, uh, oh, okay, cool. And I'm playing this and I'm like, man, this is like, really fucking boring. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm playing it, I'm playing it, and the game keeps talking me down like I'm a fucking idiot, and I'm like, dude... What happened? Because I played Pokemon uh, Emerald on a stream, like, a year or two back, and the uh -huh. game did not talk to me like I was fucking stupid. It was just like, these are Pokemon. This is the world. What is your name? What are you? Are you a boy or girl? What do you want to call your rival? Fucking dickhead. All right, cool. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. Have fun. And then they just send you on your way, like, no other issues. Well, this em is like Emerald's also, uh, like, the better version of the base game. I think the base game still treats you like a game. Uh, Ruby and Sapphire are the same opening as Emerald. They don't really talk to you in any different way. Huh. Besides, like, the only difference is that the Pokemon that you can get for the God Pokemon. Gotcha. Um, aware of yeah, so, I was playing Legends of Arceus, I'm like, man, everyone hypes this game up, but is, it, am I just old? Like, fuck. And then I'm walking around, and I never see half these Pokemon, I'm like, what the fuck is that? Why is that one a trash bag? Well, what the fuck is that? <laughs> like, I just kept getting so confused. And I'm just like, wait, you can just walk in front of Pokemon's attacks now? That's cool. And then I died instantly because I ran into something that had flamethrower. Didn't know what the fuck it was. Uh, yeah. No, dude, I've I've never been like that caught up with Pokemon anyways. I don't know what half the shit is either. Yeah, and I'm like, bro, what the fuck is happening? I mean, it's cool. I'm in feudal Japan. Pokemon with like wooden Pokeballs, and yeah, I, I guess it's cool. I can customize my character. Man, this is so fucking slow. Why is it so boring? Yeah. What the fuck is this? <laughs> and then I took it back to the GameStop. I'm like, hey man, yeah, all my friends are wrong. This game sucks. 
give it to him. He's like, oh yeah, I didn't like it, huh? I'm like, no, can I get like anything else? What'd you get? Uh, he took me over to the shelf and he said, okay, what was the last Pokemon game you played? I was like, Diamond. He handed me Brilliant Diamond. He's like, you're gonna like this. I'm like, oh shit, hell yeah. Yeah, because it's just Diamond again. <laughs> yeah. And that's what I'm used to. I, I, I like the classic Pokemon style. So I I'm playing too. Diamond. And I, I'm already about to go to my first gym, and I'm having fun with it. Because I saw my homie Piplup, and I'm like, fuck yes. I love Piplup. Piplup's cool. Uh, Turtwig's my guy for Diamond, though. I, I... On my old DS, I had to run with each of them. Turtwig is honestly a really good pick to start off with. I mean, he's a cool... He's just a cool-ass turtle, you know? Yeah. For those... For like turtle How lovers, the fuck do I get through this? All right, you died. I know, I know. I'm, I was I don't angry. I know if you but you died. No, oh. oh, I had no idea. Did you know uh, uh, 4K gaming and streaming? Uh, 4K gaming and no, wait, hold up. Streaming and 4K video editing, motherfucker. Uh, if you're gonna say it, say it right. Yeah. Streaming. Awesome. And 4K video editing. I want my shit back. But yeah, so I I had that moment where like I think I'm an old man now because none of this feels good. I, I mean, honestly, Pokemon. I had the same experience playing any of the new Pokemon games, where I'm just like, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. And then once you finally get them to shut up, you enjoy the game for a little bit, and then they continue to nag you, and you go, shut up, shut up, shut up. Yeah, I, one of my favorite things about Di playing Brilliant Diamond was I felt like a kid again. I felt like I was like 10 years old, getting ready to hop on the bus, a little chunky, just, you know, ready to just take on the day. And as I'm playing, they're like, oh yes, you remember Dawn from the anime? Oh yes, you remember Barry from the anime? I'm like, yeah, I do. They're, I like these guys. And then I played a couple minutes, I'm like, oh yeah, Barry's a fucking crackhead psychopath who's just running everywhere. Yeah. Like, you could put Barry in a Lola, and he would be the definition of Florida man. <laughs> I like the idea of Barry being from Florida. He basically is, though. Whoa. He'd just be chilling outside of a 7-Eleven asking you for 20 bucks. He does do that, doesn't he? Yeah, with his shitty little Pokemon. Ah, Barry. Fuck you, Barry. <laughs> I'm ready for you, motherfucker. You're gonna beat me in the league before you little crackhead. Who's the, um, I forget who the champion is in that game. I don't remember, and I want it to be a surprise. Oh, okay. Because my, my old man brain's like, ah, oh, yes, I remember Diamond. Me playing through Diamond. I don't remember shit from Diamond. Yeah. I just know the Pokemon. Same, I don't remember anything. I remember Dawn, I remember Barry. I remember Piplup, Turtwig, and Chimchar, who were my homies. Uh, I remember Shinx. Shinx was in it. Yes. I'm hoping to get my boy Obama Snow at some point. And I'm hoping to get my favorite Pokemon, Gengar. I know he's in it. Yeah. I didn't know Gengar was your favorite, because the moment you were looking at the other games, you are like, but this is your fucking game. Yeah, because Gengar has always been one of my favorite Pokemon since I was a little kid. I always just loved that he always was smiling and happy every time you see him, even if he was being a little mischievous little shit. He was pretty cool, too, that you had to trade him to get him to evolve. Yeah, but I never really traded him because I like Gengar. I, li I think he looks better in my opinion. But no, you you had to trade uh, Haunter to get Gengar. Did you? Because I just remember catching yeah. Gengar straight up. Uh, I think if you went to a high enough level place, you could catch Gengar. But that might be what it was. Yeah, you can't. Uh, your Haunter can't evolve into Gengar without trading. My, bro, my Pokemon knowledge is so fucked. What the hell? I swear you could just catch Gengar as is. Yeah, you. That's what I was saying. You can. It's just your Haunter can't level up into Gengar on his own. I just didn't like Haunters. So I never caught him. Fair enough. I was one of those kids where it's like, man, I don't like that Pokemon. Fuck him. And then I just go about my day. Yep. It's a hundred percent the correct way to play the game. Yeah, he does evolve from Haunter. I did not know that. And, see, my Pokemon knowledge is super limited. Carlos is the one who's, like, fucking... He, he is a Pokedex, a walking Pokedex. 
I swear, if you were to make Carlos like 15 again and tell him, you're going out into the world, here's 20 Pokeball, a Pokedex, and some running shoes, have fun, he would literally just be like, class outside, class yep. outside, and just like go around, just catching Pokemon. Oh yeah, no, he would be living his best life. Me, I would think it's cool, and I'd just look for my favorite Pokemon, and that's it. Like, I wouldn't even care about the Pokédex. I'd just be like, hell yeah. Murawak. Cubone. Gengar. Fucking, uh, Dragon Man. <laughs> oh. What's, what's, ow. What's Dragon Man? I don't know. Oh, okay. This is a, a man who's a dragon. <laughs> oh, he sounds cool. Dratini. Who is Martini but a dragon? Ooh. A drinky dragon. Drinky dragon. Yeah, it is. We'll that sounds like that sounds like something dirty. <laughs> oh, I forgot to do it. the thing. Yep. <laughs> I jumped and immediately regretted it. Like, oh fuck. But yeah, uh, I think my top, I think my dream team is honestly Gengar, Obama Snow. Fucking uh, uh, Heracross. I love me some Heracross. He's my favorite bug type. Uh, Machamp. See, unpopular opinion. Don't like Heracross. Everyone loves him. I love him because he's always like upbeat and happy. I, lo I love the Pokemon that are always smiling. Like Ludicolo. He's on my pick. Uh, yeah, not a fan Fucking of him either. What do you mean you don't like Ludicolo? Uh, I don't. It I don't know, man. I have a very different opinion of Pokemon. I like a lot of the basic bitch shit. Like, I love it when they look like just straight up animals with- You love Lil Punny. Uh, yeah, no. No, I like... no. Confirmed. You, you would fuck Lil Punny. <laughs> um, my favorite is really like, I love all the evolutions. Um, cause two of my favorite are good. Glaceon and Leafeon. Bro, you know what's funny? They first appeared in Gen 4 in Diamonds, and they're really good. I know. It, Diamond is where I really got into Pokemon. Same. Well, Emma was second for me, but Diamond was the one where I'm like, oh, oh, just like in awe with everything. Yeah, I lost my shit because at my elementary school they had a book fair. I think I already mentioned this at one point on the show, but I was like... Yeah, they had a fucking encyclopedia of, like, Pokemon, and it was laid out, like, a field, field yeah. guide or something. And I was so excited. Was, oh, what is Pokemon? I don't understand. Dude, but, I remember that book. One of my buddies had it growing up. Yeah, and but see, that's the thing, is I never played the games until later. Because, like, like much other uh, nerd culture stuff, I, didn't, I just wasn't a part of it until later. True. For me, I was like a nerd from the womb, bro. They, my parents were not ready for bullshit I brought to them. Fair. But, Ew, like, what the fuck? Oh, God. It's a mimic. That's like a mimic. That's like this game's mimic. That was cool. I don't like that. That was creepy. Uh, yeah, I didn't like it either, but it was also kind of cool. I want to know what it's poop. called. I'm gonna poop my pants. Oh, there it is. Grub yeah, it, see, it is a mimic. What the fuck? Why do they exist? Because they're hungry. Do you think there's moments where someone's like walking around with one health left and they grab one of those and the mimic fucking kills them and they get so pissed? Absolutely. Oh, there's the actual grub. <laughs> watch it. Watch it's also a mimic. That would piss me off. Now, all you what? have to do is say, do you ever think X and it's yes, I'm sure it's happened. Do you ever think someone has tried to cook taquitos covered in maple syrup, wrapped in bacon in a microwave? Oh, you mean, uh, you mean Canadian taquitos? Yeah, I make them all the time. You do not make Canadian taquitos all the time, and no, I'm, us I'm using pork bacon, not ham. So, Canadian-American taquitos. No, that's not a thing. You can't. You can't do this to me. <laughs> this is gonna gaslight you. You. Need, oh my god, just like Monty Python. Uh. Hey man, can you can you come translate this? Yeah, I got you. I 
don't even know where the fuck I'm supposed to go now. Do I love flying need... around like that. That's so cool. Do you need gamer intuition? You know, it wouldn't hurt. We're only five minutes left in the video, though. Um, then we do not need to do gamer intuition. Yeah. So why don't you go to places you haven't been before? You know, maybe I'll just go back. All the way back. And, um... Oh my god, you keep flying through the doors. Yeah, it's so cool. Look, watch, I'll keep going. Whee! <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's... Oh, no! Oh. This is my favorite power so far. I like it, too. He just looks so excited the way he's flying across. Like, yes. I am... I am now a god. Feel me. Armor clad of faith. Dude, What's down I here? Literally, after talking to my buddy about uh, uh, us, you, you and me playing Guilty Gear, mm -hmm. he's like, uh, did you play Potemkin? And I'm like, yes, of course I did. He's like, I fucking hate you. <laughs> What's wrong with Potemkin? Um, <laughs> Everything. Oh. Uh. Secrets! <gasps> Yo! Charge! Can't stop, won't stop, can't stop, won't stop. Wait, couldn't you literally just make yourself stop, though? What? Well, you know, I... I didn't want to. Can't stop, won't True. stop. Ah. Oh. God damn it, Marcus. Hang on, I got you. You're freaking up. Alright, there we go. Alright, what was the big thing that I walked by? I guess that was just this. Have we already read this? No. Higher beings, these words are for you alone. Beyond this point, you enter the land of- Oh wait, no, wait, 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 wait. This is where we entered the game from. Yeah, it is. Um, this is the- Huh. So, can we just leave? Can we get the fuck out of here? Oh! Can we go back the way we came, and like, go further back? That would be cool. I want this. Yeah, I got extra health now. Oh, that's what it is. Okay. Yeah, it's temporary extra health. Fuck you. But yeah, he just hates playing against Potemkin uh, because I... Back when I used to play somewhat proficiently... Uh, you got cut off, so you just said, I, Potemkin, eh. Yeah, 4K video editing and streaming. You know what? That actually fixed it. Good job. You're welcome. But, uh, what were you saying about Potemkin? Uh, back when I played professionally as Potemkin, I would just command grab him. All right. The time. And he just didn't like it. Well, well, I mean, that's what Potemkin does. He's the best boy. I love him. I, lo I, lo I just love big, beefy characters. Yeah, they're usually pretty good. Um, like, there's, there's a time where I wanted to actually make, play, have, like, a fighting game channel. Like, uh, Asmongold. Or a Mac, uh, whatever the other guy is. Whatever his name. Max Maxim Doodle, I think it's called. There's and a lot of guys who just play fighting games. Yeah, and I was gonna have, like, my... At the time, I had my buddy Trevor make a, uh, YouTube banner. And it was all the beefiest characters in fighting games. Oh, that sounds Like, great. it had... It had Potemkin, it had Zangief, which well, I also made. It had, um, Bob... Oh, no, not Bob. Rufus from Street Fighter V. Mm -hmm. It had, uh... Broly. It had a lot of them. Like, it was just big, beefy boys. That sounds cool. Yeah. Um, and... One of the fighting games I always wanted to play, but never got to, was, uh, the new Sam show. It looked so fun. Sam Bar Showdown? Yeah, the new one. Oh, sorry, everyone. I'm a little bit tired. Uh... It's all good. I'm a little low late. energy too. I mean, we're still keeping up good energy. To a degree. Yeah. Um, it's just late in the day. It is, and we had a long day at work. But yeah, to talk about Samurai Showdown, I remember it was like super hyped because um, fucking Evo. Evo was uh, looking for new games that wasn't fighters for once, and Sonic's Fox doing all that crap. Mm hmm. There's a big modding community for it right now. Yes. I just saw a video of Chef Boyardee and beat the fuck out of Master Chief. Ah, uh, makes sense. 
Uh, Proceeded to follow with Pac-Man fighting Chef Boy already. It's hella cursed. No, what's cursed is the characters that you can make in uh, Soul, Soul Calibur. Yes. Yep. I fucking love that game. I love Soul Calibur too. Uh, Soul Calibur 4 or 5, I can't remember which one it was. The one that was on Xbox 360 that had... Uh, uh, I think that was 5. It had Ezio? It had Ezio, yep. Yeah. That was my favorite one, because I... It was like... You know how you'd like come home from school, and play Halo, and then just like go to bed? Damn. Like one of the... One of those type of games? Yeah. That's what Soul Calibur was for me. I just eat, sleep, and breathe Soul Calibur. Yeah. It, it was really good. Uh, that was one of the Soul Calibers I only played when I uh, headed over to Evan's place because he was the big Soul Calibur fan. Mmm, uh, okay. Yeah, and then I had... I wasn't huge on Mortal Kombat. I had the the one that actually got me interested was the Mortal Kombat versus DC Universe. That's a good one. Yeah, I was like, oh shit, fighting games are cool, maybe. <laughs> yeah, but uh, damn, that's that's a lot of ass right there. Damn. What's her note say? Read her, read her diary. I mean, we already read it before. It was her being like, oh shit, he sat next to me. What am I supposed to do? Is there more written in there? It, it did look like it was new. But, I mean, we've hit the mark. We made some progress. Um, That should be good. Marcus is now flying. Yeah, I can now fly. He's um, soaring. Flying. flying. We need to do a voiceover dub of High School Musical. I'm down. We'll get Carlos involved. Hell yeah. And I, we might invite either Derek or Evan. I feel like Evan would be a lot cooler with it than Derek. Probably. I'm down for that. Uh, but as for everyone, uh, so just to reiterate, uh, tomorrow's upload for Little Nightmares will be the same. Uh, good quality. Uh, the next two to three weeks will be a little rough while I'm waiting for this new processor. So I'm going to try to find a game like this. It'll still look fine, even though it'll be a little, uh, shit. Yeah, a little, a little scuffed, but in a, we're going to say in a lovable way. So be patient, but we'll still have, you know. Hey, if Spirit Studios is known for one thing, it is not keeping consistent quality. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. We are consistently inconsistent. Yep. Anyway, thank you. Bye bye. Bye. My pee pee is hard and phallic at the same time. <laughs>